Good morning. Welcome back to a new vlog. Guess who I'm with? Who else would it be? Of course. And today we have a very fun Galentine's lunch. So we thought, well, we will take you into Harrods. Emily's already been in without me and she bought something, which we'll talk to you about soon. But now we are, because I was half an hour late, but now we are heading in together to do a nice Harrods shop, see what spring things they've got in, see what Valentine's things they've got in, and obviously take you with us. It's also the best time to go because it's so quiet and we... Oh my gosh, there's no one here. So we're gonna go do a nice little carrot shop to start the day. Oh my goodness. Yeah. These are absolutely love these ones. Wow, they've got like their cruise collection. I don't like the silver hardware. <gasps> no, I like these ones with the low backs. I really want these. How gorgeous. Sparkles. Oh my goodness. I think these are maybe a bit too blocky. I don't think they'd be very um, attractive on me. These are very reminiscent of your um, sadly lost. Oh, my Dior ones. Gone but never forgotten. Love these with the gold hardware. How do we feel about this stuff? Do you think it's gonna do well? Like it's cool, but it's maybe not my vibe. Like it's very cool and everyone's going crazy for, oh, we should pop into the actual section because I wanna see if they have Louis Vuitton cupcakes. I mean, as you know, I'm obsessed with self-portrait and look at this. <gasps> Everything is so nice. Last time I came here, I actually bought a dress from Self Portrait and it was on sale. Gosh, I love this like Parisian vibe. Oh, and I love this material. It's always so stretchy and beautiful. I actually have um, a version of this, which I love and the gold hardware. Oh, and they even have shirts, very bridal. I showed this last time, but it's literally the dress of my dreams. And this one. I actually tried this on at Christmas, but it was a little too tight on my boots and I couldn't get the right size. Although this is a new version with more sparkles on it. Yeah, my it was literally so tight on my boobs and I couldn't get the right size. I like self-portrait a lot, absolutely beautiful, beautiful brand. And the sale has now gone and we are into full price. I always think the bags are very sweet as well. Just snapped my nail, very annoying. I love this brand. We actually found it in Selfridges and then saw that they have a shop on Walton Street. And I think it's quickly become like my favorite brand. We need to have a day where we try these dresses on because look, yes, look. And actually the prices are quite good. 165 for like a premium brand. And I just think they're gonna be really nice. Oh, that could be nice actually as my bridesmaid dress. Is this champagne? No, it's milk, unfortunately. Yeah, it's tea tree on champagne, isn't it? I think it's probably it is, too, it's too, white. too white, but I do love it, nice and silky. They're like famous, I guess, for this like backless design and I am here for it. Everything looks a lot nicer now it's not the sale and it's laid out properly. You can actually see the dresses properly. It's getting me excited for spring, like this. I kind of want to look like a cake. Like I actually got to dress the other day and it's like very cakey, I'll pop it on screen. I love it and it's this kind of vibe but strapless. Yeah, so I kind of got something similar to that but strapless and long and I love how I feel like a cake. Delicious and yummy. I actually kind of, as much as I love a sale, I love that it's full price because it just looks calmer in here. Sorry, look at that. See, that's a pink. It's a bit too cakey but I'm into pink at the moment. I know, open bag, pink and this is a self-portrait bag. Do we like it? I really love me and M. I just think their pieces, oh, that's not even me and M. But generally, their pieces are so beautifully made. I've had some of their jumpers for years. Oh, that's me and M, me and M. Their stuff is amazing. Also, your outfit looks great. And I know that mine should be with white and I was gonna wear white trousers. I think white or pink is acceptable pink. No, but basically I shouldn't be wearing black shorts with them. But I needed to go comfort. I walked here and I also wanted to wear ties because it's, it's cold. It's tight weather again It's though. tight it's weather. Nice I mean, tight weather never, never left in my opinion. This is 
is my first time seeing like the Louis Vuitton, I guess, exhibition, you would say. It's interesting. Look, look, they even have a surfboard. Oh my goodness, I absolutely love this. I actually have this one and I love it, but it got some water damage. This one is stunning. I know I can't say stunning, I said too much, but I love the print. I don't like the red so much. It's literally my dream to have a set of these. I just think they are so beautiful. I am loving pink at the moment. I love that it comes with this, but it needs to be gold hardware for me. Love this one. Again, I am loving these straps. I kind of want to add this one to my Alma BP. Such a great way to change up a bag. Hey, look, the straps are a thing. This bag is lovely by itself. I prefer the other strap though. Kind of love these with like the big bold design. I kind of like that size though. This is like it's the pink. Why do I love the pink so much? Also, I love the size of this. It's so cute. So I really wanted this at Christmas and they had literally sold out. It was so annoying. And of course now they have them back in stock. Whilst we're sat waiting in Louis Vuitton to be served, I get a birthday gift. Thank you. I feel like everyone forgets my birthday because it's so close to Christmas. So the fact you even got me a present is so kind. Really you could have just written I've it had, off. I've had this present since December. Oh, you're so sweet. I giving it to you because you're such a good gift giver. I've got <laughs> gift anxiety. So if you dislike it, can you just pretend you like it? Yes. Okay, cool. <laughs> <laughs> That's so kind. I would never dislike a bag. That's so kind. I'm excited for it to open. Oh my god, I can see oh my Okay, let's go to the car first. Basically, this is what we do when we're waiting for ourselves. <laughs> we are. Oh, sorry. If anyone knew, my birthday's in December. But everyone's just so busy in December. Oh, didn't we even know? Yeah, we did celebrate my birthday. We had the best birthday On the 10th of December. December. No, we did the 22nd together. My actual oh, well, birthday yeah. together. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> Fanny flutters. It's Charles Leclerc. I'm obsessed with him. <laughs> if you know, you know. Oh, my God. I really love really Claire about you. Oh, my God. You have some serious effort into that. card that came with the bag. This is a, a gold Harrods envelope. Remember when you got the keys to your house and I got your Harrods hamper? Cool. It was her mature because she didn't move in, but I just love that it came all wrapped up. Oh, this is like a birthday present on boxing. Something to elevate your day. Goodbye random totes. Wait for it. <laughs> Emily actually texted me and said, you don't need to bring a tote down. I was like, I'm bringing a tote. And I brought a tote. Always random totes. No, you have to have a random tote. It ruins my Random outfit. totes, no but, more. But I always need a random tote. Oh, is it gorgeous? Look at the colour. Oh my god. I love that. No black, see? She says no black. No black? And I'm wearing black shorts and black I want to buy the same one. Color. Mine's a bit old. Oh my god. So I have I have the I have the black one, but I actually gave it to my mum. Um because I Hello. Hi. Emily, right? This yes. is Emily. Emily. Yeah. Hi. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. How are you? That was exquisite timing. I was just about to show you and then Emily started to get served. She blends in so well with the shop right now. But oh my gosh, I can't believe that. I'm so happy. Oh my gosh, look. They have the machine. They have the they have the machine. How do we use it? I don't have any money. It doesn't say. I kind of want one, I'm not going to lie. Louis Vuitton cakes, that's the coolest thing ever. Oh my gosh, look at these. The show chocolate. Shoe, lemon, and honey. This is so exciting. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, which one should we get then? I would actually get the chocolate one though. So I just think it's going to taste nicer. You can get Louis Vuitton macarons. You can get these. Oh my gosh. So exciting. Although I like these because they actually say Louis Vuitton on them. I love that they have this. You have to line up, unfortunately. But how fun. I do love this Saleron in here. It's just so calm and easy. Oh my gosh, sorry, look at these. They have them in leather now. 
Yeah, but I like the lab version. Look how ruined it gets though. It's so scratched. Is it meant to be scratched? No, but it's like, did they do that on purpose? The black one's better. It's the mini version of mine. I like it in this color and oh, I like this design. They brought Gucci bags out in pink and green. What were you saying about pink and green? Pink and green is a vibe. So I love this bag, but it's really hard when you like pull it. It's a bit stiff, but I love the moon shape. I've done a full video review of it actually. I kind of like the green and the pink actually. Pink and green is a thing. Sorry, I actually love this print. This is a print of my Gucci scarf. I don't like the purple, but I do like the green. <gasps> no, it's the pink. Oh my gosh, please get this cat. I like the pink. Oh my gosh, I love it. They've got mules as well. Oh my gosh, yeah, it's really incredible. Cool. Okay, I think I need a pink bag. A dream. They've got yellow as well. I am so into the pink vibe. I'm sorry, I didn't think I needed a pink bag and then I saw this range and now I'm like, I need a pink bag. <gasps> Beautiful. So many people have messaged me being like, can you tell me which bag you bought? Well, here's a secret. I haven't bought it yet because I went to Miami the next day and I wanted to come and have a proper shopping experience. So I need to come in and do a full day where I pick up chosen bag. And also you guys really didn't like it, which kind of scared me. Yeah, we need to come for like, a, I want to do a proper date day where I come and like pick up my bag. I also really want this. We should come and do like an afternoon tea and make a proper day of it and actually do like a picking up my bag style day. I'm just so torn. I love Christian Dior so much. Like this range, I love it so much, but it's not future proof. I know, it's absolutely beautiful and it's so calm in here. I love everything. I'm attracting pink at the moment. I love that scarf for spring. Oh my God, it's so tiny. <gasps> I love it. I've not seen it that tiny before. I've only seen that one. Oh my gosh, and I like it with the pink again. She's going for the pink vibe. <gasps> and it has a little strap. Sorry, that's so cute. It's actually the perfect size, you know. It's probably not that much smaller than this. It just looks cuter. I love that. I love that. Yeah, would you not get the pink? Yeah, like, after lunch. This is the, this is the color that everyone gets. You know I love anything fluffy and boucle. This is like the boucle bag of dreams. Yeah, good for skiing actually, not good for summer, but good for skiing. <gasps> no, I actually kind of prefer that one. I mean, they're gonna get ruined. It's like the coach bag that I tried. I like the mini as well. Never look at me, Mew, actually. Quite like that today. Hurry, is that a copy of the Jackie? Because that looks so much like the Jackie bag. But that's kind of wild to me, how similar it looks. I love this. Of course I want to go in the food hall. H how long will ladder at last? Because I want to get Matt some for Valentine's Day. Like, will it last? Well, this is a problem. It, I, I'm going to eat the whole thing. You know, Harrods have done a much better job of Valentine's and Selfridges already because they've got all the pink laid out and they've got heart-shaped things. I just love heart-shaped things. <gasps> I love baklava. Get some baklava. I would get a mini one though. I don't think it tastes. So we much. have such an exciting lunch ahead. Um, I love baklava so much, but I prefer the smaller ones. I think it tastes nicer. I am gonna get some ladder out there. Ooh, they have a sale. Yum, I love a chocolate sale. How have we never seen these before? They're like little cones of chocolate. How fun is that? Oh, they have samples we should try. Everything's so romantic and I love anything romantic. I'm honestly a sucker for anything seasonal. Oh no, she's found the goods. Also, tell them what you bought from Chanel. I got some shoes for my holiday with I'm so excited and for I'm you, like baby. This yes. Is 60. 100. Oh. How many chocolates do you get today? Guys, you probably know this, but we are ladder rack obsessed. 72. This one looks like my dream. Oh my gosh, I need this. I'm gonna buy some for Matt for Valentine's because he absolutely loves it. But I need to figure out which one to get him. Basically, my boyfriend loves this brand, so getting him some Valentine's treats. Yay, look, there's the bag of all the goodness. I just finished trying some. I ended up going for the cornflake and the salted caramel. 
honestly, this is also my favourite that Matt does not like coconut, so I can't get away with that. What are you buying, Mrs? My suitcase. My suitcase. The thing is, it's just the best. I mean, I love Hotel Chocolat, I love Cadbury, but when I'm going super luxe, I go ladder rack. It's next level, yeah. These are very cute, though. Yay! Emily with the Chanel, me with the ladder rack. <laughs> I love it. I think I would cry if someone bought me this, but the problem is I would then eat the entire thing. So it's better to just buy it in slab form instead. It's these two ladder act together and stay together. <gasps> yeah, we love it. Yeah. You know, my favorite chocolate right now is Conflate chocolate, the one we get from Carpo. I'm obsessed with it. Although, oh no, I think this is Conflate chocolate. No. <gasps> oh my God, since when? Kylie chocolate you just know that people are gonna buy this for valentine's sorry no this is incredible <gasps> sorry kylie has a range of valentine's range in harrods this is incredible how beautiful do the lips look wow oh my gosh i need these look a lot thicker sea salt, sea salt and caramel these are a lot thicker than ladderack like look how chunky they are yeah. Oh my goodness, that is a slab. Gosh, it's cool. We love chocolate. We can't come in here without buying something. It's a problem. I just think it's so aesthetic in here. Like, look how beautifully laid out that is. Look at these, everything's pink. Oh my gosh, how beautiful is that? Look at the cheese. Okay, so where's our favorite place in Harrods? The rotisserie. If we didn't have lunch, I would be getting a rotisserie box or a rotisserie sandwich. You basically choose your bread, always get sourdough, or you can have a box and it's basically like a roast dinner in a box. It's the best. It's very much if you know, you know. I always pop in here and get this for dinner. It's a problem. It smells so good in here. Another thing that I want to get Matt, actually, I want to get him some really special wine. I think I might go to a local wine shop, but I basically want to get him some cap. I have some here. And I want to get him a Primitivo because that's his favorite wine. We're going classy this Valentine's. I just want to come and do all my shopping in here. It would be my dream to like be able to come and do my shopping in here. My grocery shopping, that is. They do the most amazing salad boxes, grab and go. I literally prefer the food hall to actual shopping in Harrods. These sandwiches are a work of art. I've switched the word stunning for work of art. I'm saying it all the time. But this is a work of art. How can you not just be obsessed with this? This is the one of sandwiches that everyone raised about. Do they? Is this like, oh yeah, 28 pounds. We have a famous viral Wagyu sandwich. Should we go halves? <laughs> Absolutely not. James actually bought it and loved it. Did he? Annoying. It was good. So, yeah, of course it's good. How annoying. Oh my gosh, I'm sorry. I love rhubarb. Fun fact, a lot of rhubarb comes from Yorkshire because Yorkshire is like genuinely the capital of rhubarb. For those that don't know, hi, I'm from Yorkshire. <laughs> um, look how pretty it looks. I love rhubarb season and it's forced. They basically grow it in the dark, pick it by candlelight. And that is why it's so beautiful and pink and sweet. I mean, you're meant to put like quite a lot of sugar with rhubarb. However, this one is sweeter because it's forced rhubarb, fun fact. So this brand, I always order it online from Harrods or Selfridges if I need like just good cupcakes to send someone because they're actually really good. They look like very flat and I prefer like a lot of frosting, but they're really great. And look, they have Valentine's ones. It's just a really nice gift and they're not too expensive, but their quality is very high. These pretzels, absolutely incredible. And these scones. Comment below, do you say scone or scone? Like scone, a cone or scone? <gasps> these look great, don't they? Very cheesy. Oh my gosh. See, these will be better when they've been in the oven. But when they've been in the oven, they will be amazing. Oh, I love fig. Anything figgy, get figgy with it. It gets me excited. And this is one of our favorite spots to have coffee. There's a guy who works there called George and he writes like princess and stuff on top of the coffee. It's very cute.
look how gorgeous this is. I'm into sprinklings, anything like, I don't know what you call it, hundreds and thousands. Oh my God, a Valentine's cake. Oh yeah, they're gonna have all the Valentine's cupcakes. So these are the kind of cupcakes that I prefer, but obviously you can't ship them across the UK. Yeah. <gasps> look at these ones, incredible. And they bake all of this, I guess, with the afternoon tea. I love this brand in Harrods. I know it's the Harrods brand, but I mean, I love the branding. I was in Heathrow recently and my friend was buying something for her American friend and she actually ended up getting like this range because it's just so beautiful and old school. Like I much prefer it to this kind of newer range. And if I need a gift, I will definitely come to Harrods or go online and be buying this. I just think the branding will look so nice in anyone's kitchen. Oh yes, we have found the Valentine's section so much better than selfridges no way they have a sale oh my gosh we should literally come in here the day after valentine's and get everything reduced like these are already reduced how fantastic oh it says i love you that's very tempting oh and it runs out of date on may oh i should maybe get one <gasps> oh my gosh everything's pink yes i know that people think valentine's is a consumer's dream i am that consumer I love everything. I'm easily influenced. <gasps> oh my gosh. Yeah, I actually got one of these for myself on my birthday, 35 pounds. You know, that's really not that bad. It just annoys me. I like biscuitiers, but it does annoy me that they are just the old biscuitiers. But they are pretty. I don't know, I feel like, like I like biscuitiers, but they're charging a premium for Dior ones. Oh, they're cheap and all. I mean, Biscuitiers isn't exactly cheap, but I mean, I'm not gonna lie, if someone gave me that Valentine's Day, I'd probably cry. They even have Christmas cakes on sale still. Get your Christmas cake for next year. I wonder what the sell by date is on these things that are heavily reduced. Um, I can't even tell because it's completely worn out. Oh, the 9th, so you could use this until September. I guess you wouldn't eat a Christmas pudding. And these are all, oh my God, it's the cakes that we like, Fiona Cans. <gasps> Oh my gosh, and they're reduced to 17.50. Guys, if you need to come and get a birthday cake, get one of these. Okay, so they also have these hearts. Oh, the lollipops. How pretty. I actually have a bottle of this at home, which I haven't opened yet because it's just so pretty. But I definitely want to get my boyfriend like a nice, a nice gift from here. I mean, if he's watching this vlog and wants to get me this for Valentine's, that would be special. So I've never actually eaten in the Harris dining hall. But in case you wanted to see, this is the Harrods Dining Hall. It's very kind of like Gatsby-esque inside. I was just saying, I've never actually eaten in here. So I recommend carriages to all my friends, but carriages in the Corinthia. But this yeah. is if you wanted to have like, let's say premium fish and chips. I mean, the best fish and chips are like on the coast, but apparently these ones are great. Can't believe they have pastry evangelists in there. And then they also have these, but honestly, we would just eat in Harrods at the rotisserie or upstairs for afternoon tea, but this is really pretty. Yeah, I know. Um, yeah, we need to go. We'll do that on the Dior bag buying day. Ah, oh, imagine that for Valentine's Day. So pretty. I know, I just love Elemis. This is a really nice Elemis counter, isn't it? It's huge. Also, this range I absolutely love. This is great for if you are traveling, pop it in your handbag. And also, these are really good. I mean, everyone knows I'm obsessed with these. I don't think I've ever been in here, but this is basically like the fragrance section on the ground floor. It's really pretty. I mean, I've been to Diptyque, but I don't think I've been to this section of Diptyque. Emily just wants to quickly go to Penn Halligans. Oh no, I tell a lie actually. I think this is the Diptyque I've been to. Gosh, I love this brand. I actually have this in my kitchen and it just looks so beautiful. Oh, you wanted to go to Penn Halligans? They were really helpful at this Diptyque actually. Into Penn Halligans. Oh my gosh, it's so beautiful in here. I've always wanted to go to this champagne bar. I feel like what we need to do is choose our handbag of choice. And we need to basically just spend the whole day in Harrods, do a breakfast, do a lunch, and then end here and celebrate our handbags. Celebrate the handbags in here. I'm telling you, we're gonna come for breakfast, we're gonna do blow-dry nails, buy bags, have some champagne, you know, do the lot. Do it all. 
Oh, I love Gucci Beauty. I think it's underrated. Like the packaging is so pretty. How beautiful. I nearly said stunning, then I realized I she said it. she went stuns. I don't think I've shown this on the vlog yet, but how wild is that? And you can see it when you're going up the escalators. It is wild. I think this is the first time we're gonna to come to Harrods and not go to Carpo and get chocolates afterwards. But yeah, look, it's, I don't even think the video shows how big this is. Okay, that was cute. We both got ladder rack. Emily got a little Chanel treat. Oh my gosh, I know, how exciting. She got some cute little, what can I say? Got some shoesy shoes. Some shoesy shoes. And now we are just going to go into Zara, which is next to Harrods. Can I just say, going to Harrods on a what day is it? Thursday morning-ish is great. There was no one in there. No one bothers you. The service is always they're amazing. so attentive. They're attentive, but they're chill. It's like the right level. Yeah, because they can actually talk to you like a person because they're not having to do, you know, conveyor belt of customers. Yeah. They're just like, hey, straight. In. And we did also want to go on the grabbers. I don't know what you call them. I call them grabbers. What do you call them? Yeah, grabbers. The thing that like drops toys and you like, it grabs it. Comment below if you call it something different. What would you call it? It's like an arcade game. I would call it a grabber. grabber. Well, the grabber, we wanted to go on that. I don't know what you can win, but then I, I jumped on it and she was like, no, there's a line. And the line was really long. So we didn't do that. But honestly, it was a great experience today. It was super calm, super chill. And I know so many of you have messaged saying you want to, yeah, I've had so many messages on Instagram. I'm like, which bag did you buy? But the day I went in to I, test the I bags, the, same. the day I went in to test the bags, it was the day before I got a flight to Miami. But I thought you were going the next morning. I was going the next, well, I was going to go back the next morning with Matt to buy it. And then I realized I wanted to do a proper experience where I like vlogged it and did a come and buy my bag with me. So if you guys would like that, tell me because Emily and I think we're gonna do like a full day. I wanna make like a day of it. It's an expensive 24 item. 24 hours in Harrods. Yeah, it's an expensive item. I wanna do like a breakfast and then a coffee and then go and buy my bag and properly like film the experience. I don't wanna rush. We could do, you know what we could do on that day? I could take to the uh, Asian restaurant. <gasps> Chai Wu. I love Chai Wu. That was my Christmas present. Yeah, we can go to Chai Wu because it's great. We basically wanna like really have a proper date girls day for when I get the bag. I don't want to just go in after work one night or rush one morning and be a, be a, a rush. Yeah, it's memorable. Yeah. No, I get that. So I, yeah. you you will find out. I, I take buying my bags very seriously. Oh, wow. oh, okay, so Emily's saying I have a friend. She does, the lady's looking at me. What happened? So See funny. what happened? Wait, give me two seconds until she's walking past she's staring at me. So the lady came up to Em and went, oh, um, love your shoes, where are they from? These ones. And went, oh, Amazon. And I was like, what brand, what brand? So Em was like, oh, there, drop you the link. It was so cute. Yeah, but I was like, I was trying to she explain. Was she was I so showed her on my phone. I was like, they're Amazon. And she's like, what brand? And I was like, I don't know what brand they are. I just found them on Amazon. And I was like, and everyone asked me about these shoes. They're so comfy. They were so cheap. And like, as I said, I don't want to be wearing black today with this gorgeous cardigan. But I'm having to wear black because it's kind of cold. I wish I was wearing white. <laughs> it would but look she, so much better in my cardigan, but she was so sweet. She was saying to her husband, she's like, how do I airdrop? I want the shoes. And she was like, I was like, let me just take your number and I will literally send you a screenshot of the page you need to go on. And she was so nice. So for you guys, I'll link it below. <laughs> That's easy, isn't it? I nearly said, oh, follow me on YouTube. I I'm just thought filming it was really a vlog. Sweet. I know, okay, so we need to go to Zara next because it's opposite. So let's quickly pop into Zara, show you what's in there, and then we're gonna head up Regent Street. Okay, next stop. Zara. How nice is this? Like, I don't know. With the with the spring print on, I feel finally everything is spring. Like, oh my gosh, that's really cute. How nice is that? Oh, I like that one. I'm actually really into navy. That's very nice. Look, they basically got all their Valentine stuff out. Perfect excuse to wear pink or red, even just for yourself. But this section is more my vibe. I get excited by Valentine's, but I love neutrals, love stripes, anything striped. Yeah, I was just saying this section is very my vibe. I love this. How beautiful is that? Wow, again, very ski chic. Ski chic. It's massively a thing at the moment. It's very like Parisian, I know. I've had these for years. I have one of these for like six yeah, years. Yeah, but I still love them. I just wish I got the hardware was gold. Yeah. Zara do great with gold hardware and that should not be silver in my opinion. I think this is beautiful, I know, and it has matching. I thought they were actually shorts, now it's a skirt. I think this is very nice. 
I know. I can't wait to start wearing white. I hate that I'm wearing black today because it's so cold. Ew. Nice little colorway. Yeah, spring is coming. I'm into these sets again. Look at the skirt and jumper set. That's really nice. Love that. And the roll neck. These are wild. Not a vibe in my opinion. They are so big. I think they would break my ears off. They'd probably look really cool on a model, but on me, they would break my ears off. Oh my gosh, the furry jumper. It is a vibe. I'm sorry, I love it. I prefer this version. This with like a matching skirt would be gorgeous. So my outfit today, I'm actually obsessed with this cardigan. However, I wouldn't want to wear it like this. <laughs> the only reason I'm wearing it with this is because it's cold outside, but normally I would wear it with like your trousers. I can't wait to wear it with white trousers. Um, that was the original plan. This is very cute. Oh, I love this. Oh, these are shorts, absolutely lovely. Sorry, the music is having a bit of a trouble inside the shop. This is beautiful. Gosh, I love this. Stripes are everywhere at the moment, and also the quality of this is actually really nice. This is a striped hoodie, but then I do actually love like half zip. This is really nice, half zip little jumper. Actually, you could probably wear that as a jumper dress if you got it oversized, maybe. Wanted to know what Emily's shoes are like. Like that. Literally, just turn this car into a pair of shoes. Wow, look at it. It's so sparkly. Can't believe it. Literally glistening. Okay, we are out of Zara and Harrods actually. So, the little unboxing that I did in Harrods. Sorry, I got good off because the sales assistant came over. And he was actually really nice. He didn't care. We he didn't like, care. We were just like doing a full unboxing. Oh, I had like all oh, my birthday presents. I didn't know if he was coming over. Oh my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Silence. I didn't know if he was coming over to be like, girls, can you not film? I was, was like, there doing like a full on vlog. I was there doing a full on vlog in there. Doing like a present unboxing. Anyway, thank you. They are the most thoughtful, incredible presents. I can't wait to use my toe. I'm so scared to, it's like scary to buy gifts. I'm not. You are. My love language, I like to give gifts like thoughtful gifts i just like to do it i like to give myself but it doesn't mean that i but it doesn't I mean I that like. i expect to receive gifts so that is very very oh, kind no, i never feel pressure to buy you gifts but when i it want is very to, kind it means a lot i'm to like me. oh my gosh what if she doesn't like it see i'm not used to being to people being thoughtful like it's etiquette in my opinion that if you go to someone's house you should absolutely take something and i always would but a lot of people don't so when people do i'm always shocked because i'm not used to people having that etiquette you're that friend that would you be friends with in primary school you come back from like i don't know the seaside and you bring a stick of rock for everyone I, always i would go on a holiday and take everyone a bag of candy and like if i go to someone's house and they're doing a dinner party which i love you to host i will always take them like a bottle of gin a bottle of wine some flowers some chocolates i'll take Chocolate a cake fun cake over to Thanksgiving. but like it's just etiquette but a lot of people don't do that um which i always find interesting it's just different different etiquettes but zara was good Lots of stripes, some pink, some red for Valentine's. Now we are heading over to lunch at, do do do, wait and see. It's gonna be a good one. It's gonna be it's, uh, a good not one. not pink anymore. Oh, it's not pink, pink. that's the hint. <laughs> but I'm wearing pink to make up for it. Oh, London, you are so beautiful. Street, one of my favorite streets in London for shopping and at Christmas it is so nice it's called New Bond Street no it's Old Bond Street right New Bond Street, New Bond Street. Oh. okay so we're on Old Bond Street now and then it turns into New Bond Street this Ralph Lauren cafe is beautiful and then this is a car chain that gets all of the beautiful lights outside at Christmas time if I sound out of breath it's because I am because we're running late to lunch <laughs> we are stomping we won't be late, it's all good. This Louis Vuitton store actually looks nicer than Harrods. It's fun. 
very cute and also maybe i should get my dior bag from this store and i love this chanel however i want harrods points so that's why i need to get it from harrods but this would be a nice experience going to the chanel or dior And now into free people. So how was afternoon tea? And now we are in free people to finish the day. It is the next day after the Harrods shopping. I hope you enjoyed coming to Harrods. I just actually got a huge order, so I thought, oh, I'm gonna quickly show you it. I'm gonna quickly do a try on. Oh my goodness, I also got a Canada goose. <gasps> I can't wait to show you, but first I'm gonna show you some spring dresses because the sun is shining. I am in love with this. I ordered this stuff like a week ago, and because I was like, oh, we're gonna have some nice weather, I'm actually in love. Like. The quality is really great, it fits really nice and it's making me just want to have amazing spring weather and go on a lovely trip. I'm so impressed, I feel like this is such a classy one. Okay then this one, I'm sorry, how amazing is this? I feel like this is so classy, I'm literally in love with it. Lace, gorgeous, classy, I'll link everything below, obviously. I need to adjust the straps, but this one too, I was wearing it and Matt was like, oh my gosh, I love that dress. So it got the boyfriend seal of approval. I feel like they're just gonna be so nice and easy to wear for spring. Okay, the pile of clothes next to me keeps getting bigger and bigger as I open more packages. <gasps> but look, I actually went for the long version because I think it's gonna keep me warm. I may have a trip coming up. And as Emily and I always say when we're shopping and looking at coats, you need to keep the bum warm. And this is called, I'll link it below, but this is called gray. It's definitely more like lilac lavender. I mean, I love it. And it's so nice. I'll fasten it up and show you properly. And then underneath, I'll link these below as well. Oh my gosh, I just popped this on Instagram and so many people asked me where it was from. It's so comfy. And I'm wearing it with their leggings, which actually, wait, other side. Oh, they have a lovely little pocket here. So handy for when you're running if you need to pop like gels in there, headphones, AirPods, case. They are such comfy leggings. I'm like massively into my Gymshark, my Adenola, my Lulu, my Sweaty Betty. I love them all. And it's hard for me to find new leggings that I love. And these, I am so impressed. This is size extra small. They are butter soft, so comfortable. I need a major house tidy up. I'm aware of that. And I blocked out my entire weekend to sort my house out. <gasps> there it is, buttoned up, buttoned, fastened. Ah, oh, I love it because it's like casual. You can wear it around London, but then I can also wear it on a trip I might have coming up. And I actually love the colour. I've seen a really nice like metallic green one on their website. I'll pop it on screen. It's amazing. I can't stop thinking about it. It's like really padded and really puffed and just mm, amazing. It's going to look so good on like winter trip. And I also got home to these. The most beautiful spring delivery. I love eucalyptus and I love spring flowers. It's a new dawn. It's a new day. It's a new life. I can't sing. Lots of bits and bobs to show you. I filmed some stuff the other day because I've got some gorgeous, I've got a mix of things. I have a ski trip coming up, which there's gonna be a full video about. So I basically have a mix of things. I've got the Canada Goose, which is obviously like ski wear. And then I also have some cute spring items I wanted to show you. I've also got some home wear. I'm so excited. I'll give you a little sneak peek on this vlog as well. And then, oh my goodness, I got a new side table. I'm obsessed with it. It's the love of my life. I'm so excited. And then I got this which is storage, oh, and basically this lifts up. Love this so much, I love the ruffle. I just think I'm gonna wear this all spring long. Another home piece, I got a new fruit bowl. I am so overly excited about this fruit bowl. Okay, I need to put a bra on with this and I do have a similar one, <gasps> but I love this. Would this not be the most perfect summer holiday such bridal piece? My friend's getting married and I was like, you can totally borrow this 
for your Hindu. It's a British one, so it's a Hindu, not a bachelorette this time. Or for your honeymoon, but low-key me as a non-bride i absolutely love this i also have a summer trip coming up well it's a spring trip and i'm so excited i'm going from snow to sunshine and i just think this is going to be perfect such high quality i'm obsessed with the bow okay i need to tan but i got this as like a potential holiday slash wedding guest dress i don't think it would pass as a wedding guest dress maybe like a wedding party abroad but i absolutely love it and it's so comfortable like it literally hugs my body and feels so soft and comfortable okay absolutely obsessed with this one again wedding guest kind of vibe i don't know if i've actually got this on properly okay thanks for bearing with me it took so long but it's now dark outside so it's basically a tie here and then it does have a little skirt underneath I just think this is so nice. I cannot wait to wear this for one of the bachelorettes that I have coming up. And again, it's really comfortable. And I would definitely wear this for dinner in London. Okay, straight into the leggings now. As you can tell, we are back onto ski season. I love this jumper. I think this jumper is just the cutest thing. And it's, again, so warm, so comfy. For some reason, I just love a jumper with like a neck bit and a cutout part. I got this coat because I was really inspired by Emily. It looks way better on her. This is actually the men's version. And it's just not a vibe on me, but like it sells out everywhere and people are obsessed with it. I did also get this coat, but they only had one size left. So I had to get it oversized. And because it has shoulder pads, it just looks a bit silly on me. But I wanted to show you it because I honestly think if you were maybe taller than me, this would look incredible. I'll show you it belted in a second. Like I'm so warm and snuggly and the quality is so good. Let me just fasten this up for you. Look, you can see it's such great quality. It's so snuggly. Also, you can see the top absolutely love it and i really want to love this but on the shoulders it's just too big for me but oh my goodness how comfortable and snuggly is that like literally amazing i will link it below in case some other sizes come back in stock i would really like to exchange this for a smaller size i said we were on to some more ski stuff oh my goodness is this not the cutest thing you've ever seen? With like the little hearts on it. It had to show you my new Canada Goose with this underneath because I actually think, gosh, I've got hair on my face. The colors go so well together. You may have seen it on my Instagram. I'm wearing it literally every day. I need to save it for my ski trip, but I'm wearing it every single day. I absolutely love it. Let me just show you it fastened as well because fastens also look. Oh, look at the hearts. You're so cute. Okay, so it's just got a little thing like that. Fastens. Oh. I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it, I love Hello it. guys, welcome to my very, very messy bedroom. This marks the end of the Harrods vlog. I'm sorry, that was such a long vlog, but there was so much I wanted to show you. I hope you enjoyed coming to Harrods. I hope you enjoyed, oh my gosh, I have eaten so much Ladderack since filming that. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed the try on, the next vlog. There's loads of vlogs coming. I upload every Friday, every Sunday. I have a ski trip where you'll see which outfits I go for. I then have a summery spring trip. And now I'm actually just heading for afternoon tea, but that will be in another vlog. But I just wanted to hop on and say thank you so much. And I just had such a great week. So thank you for coming along with me. Definitely Harrods. It's just my favourite place to shop in London. It's so great. Harrods and Regent Street, for me, if we're going shopping in London, are great. So I hope you enjoyed coming along with me. Sorry for all the excitement and chaos and so many things going on. But if you made it this far, because I know this was very long, comment and tell me your favourite type of chocolate. Is it salted caramel? Is it cornflake chocolate? Is it Kinder Bueno? Is it Cabri? Is it Lint? It can be a brand. It can be a type. I'm a salted caramel girl. And thank you so much for watching. Come say hi on Instagram at mshellx. All my love.